It's a very, very steep drop off. To get to the Bob Thompson Peak Trailhead, take State Route 92 south from Sierra Vista and then turn west onto Ash Canyon Road. After about two miles on a dirt road, the road forks and you'll follow the Ash Canyon sign onto the left fork. Then it's another half mile to the parking area. The hike is about four miles round trip, starting up a steep old mining road that's now used mainly by the Border Patrol. The only indication of the route is the Forest Road 4784 sign, a few hundred yards after you start your hike. And this seems like a good point in this video to mention the Trails of the Huachuca's Trail Guide. As you know, I always recommend using Leonard Taylor's Trails of the Huachuca's Trail Guide. It is really the definitive source of trail information in the Huachucas. Many people these days use all trails, and all trails has 25 or 30 trails within the Huachucas listed in it, whereas there are actually about 70 or so trails. So you're missing out on quite a bit if you don't have the trail guide. But at any rate, getting back to the hike, the first section of the route is about a mile and a half up to this rock outcropping. And that's exactly what you think would be Bob Thompson Peak. But it isn't. Bob Thompson Peak is actually hidden from sight about a quarter mile to the east. And getting past the rock outcropping is where the sketchy section of the route is. First, continue up the road. Eventually, you get to the saddle and head east for a quarter mile. This is where you have to decide if you're comfortable with the 100 to 200 yards of steep drop off as you go around the outcropping. And now that we're finally at the big lump, we take a very faint route around it to Bob Thompson behind. Just a little bit more, over to the peak. At the peak, there are great views of Smuggler's Ridge and Coronado National Memorial, and all around. And then it was back the way I came, around the sketchy rock section, along the ridge, and then down Forest Road 4784. All in all, this hike was four and a half miles round trip with 1,700 or so feet of elevation gain. I really hope you have a chance to get out and hike some of the trails in the Huachucas and learn more about the history of this area. There's a link at the end of this video that can point you in the right direction or check out one of the mini playlists that I've put together, and I think you'll find a hike that suits you. And I'll see you on the next hike.